It's Halloween. So, uh, let's see what we got to review. Sounds like the uh, family friendly version and family version and the theatrical version. Both well, still the same story. Again, much like the first one, it has less in the movie than the theatrical version. So. <laughs> Yeah, much like the first one, it's still fun to watch. Uh, so the movie is about a, this guy that's very immature and irresponsible and uh, doesn't want a kid right now. His wife does. Um, and his... And the business of dressing funny and he goes to his head is that he um talks about um drawing he's a good drawer and can and he says like and he says come up with something that no one has ever come up with before and he says yeah, I can do that so he's trying to come up with something, and um, this is a really touching moment when um, he, uh, for his wife, he um, shows her a little cartoon drawing of him and stuff of him and her, and him with him pulling his out his eye. It's a really touching moment. Uh, uh. Uh, yeah, it shows that he has, um, he's a, uh, it shows that he has good moments, the movie has good moments like that, um, and, um, this low-key guy that's trying to please his father by getting the mask, he tried getting him at museum, only he was still find a fake. And him and his father doesn't know where the real mask is, so a baby has been born. Um, that is, has the powers of the mask, was born from the guy who put on the mask, so it was born inside the mask, which was the father that put on the mask at a party, and did a bunch of, uh, version of the song of I love you babe uh, it's too good to good to be true and the rap version of the song you know the country the bunch of uh, sing um and cast a uh, uh, honking and stuff and uh, <coughs> But it's not necessary. It's just I every mean, so the guy that uh, told him to draw something, uh, this character of the mask, the that he uh pitches his idea uh that he came as. Uh, he thought he he thought it was, it was a genius idea. He was yeah he yeah, anyway he uh. Has sex with his wife when he was wearing the mask, and the base point he has all of these uh, abilities to break the laws of physics and act like a cartoon character.
So, Loki is on his quest to find the right baby and goes through houses and houses and until he can find the right, right one. And meanwhile, uh, the baby's driving his father mental, and so in his plan is to uh, for him to be locked in a mental institution, and because he feels he's because he's not feeling the love that from his father, so. Um. And he does that by, and he famously succeeds. Then uh, Loki realizes that the baby is the mask that is the right baby, and go as after it. And <laughs> my sis, oh my god, baby, so first we're going to take you in. first. First, we're going to take you to get it, get an exes, <laughs> exes. So, and, and uh, he said the word Padre, <laughs> and uh, his dad's like looking at what the heck does Padre mean. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Dad. Hello. Are you listening to this? Yeah. What do you think of this movie? I need to So, anyway, uh, Loki runs them into a corner and he uh, tries to kill. Uh, Fire the spawn at the uh, that uh, which would kill the father would and kill the baby. So the baby shields the father from the uh, explosive because <laughs> because um, he wouldn't and he, and he because uh, the baby likes the loves his dad now because. He wouldn't uh, let him have his baby lo to lo hand the baby to Loki. So Loki loses his powers by his father and has his brain how his father messes things up and says, "This baby is the one." I was just close until you interfered. So he gets his powers back. And he steals the baby after messing with the father of it. And, um, in the father's mind, and tells him what the plan is that he challenges him. Uh, and so, with to meet him, Red Lobster, so. Uh, at this time, and the wife comes home, and uh, he sounds crazy by I because he first attacks his wife <laughs> because he thinks this Loki, <laughs> and then he realizes, oh wait, that's shit, that's his wife. <laughs> um. Then explains the whole thing that's go, what's going on, and he puts on the mask uh, after he gets it from his dog that's on a date, and which leads to this very heartwarming moment when the dog says that he's the one. He tells the dog that he's gonna be like your little brother, and he's gonna need you. And he, but right now he needs ya. And he, and when he's like all big, you know, he's gonna be like your little brother. You know, be his like his big brother. You gonna play together. And which, um, 
um, the dog is is one over and takes the mask off and uh, um, after the baby bonds with low key he says he doesn't want he, uh, to give back the baby he groans attached so he wants the baby and the mask and the father puts on the baby the, that means it puts on the mask. <laughs> How am I doing here? Yeah. And they have a the racing together. They race each other and they fight each other. And then they decide to let the baby choose who to who, who's who choose who and uh. <sighs> Uh, the father wins over the baby by him taking off the mask. And the baby says, Dad, yeah, Dad, yeah, for the first time. And so, Loki doesn't take this well, and he just goes full on Super Saiyan on them, on the family. And uh, while trying to hammer them, the father lifts his the hammer for uh, uh, and uh, and this is uh, what they what it was uh, this is what it came out as and this is how it was originally intended through the power of being the uh, the love of the power of being a father and. His love for his son is what makes him lift a giant hammer, and that's what it was meant to represent on the commentary. So it translates very well. And, um, so, Odin interferes again, and, Talks how he's going to banish him and how from and take away his powers and how he's a disgrace, how he'll be a disgrace to be as a son. And uh, the the our main character says, "Hold the phone, like you hold it, just hold it." I don't know how things works in as a demigod, but he's your son. You're his father. So you got, so you, so you have like many years to live. So you might as well make up now. And here, here's the mask. And everything's good. Everything lives happily ever after. And um, uh, I mean, character has a new cartoon show about a. Dog and a baby. Uh, do you and Tom and Cherry thing while trying to win uh, over the family? Uh, be the family stuff. They'll have the family and while attacking each other. Uh, he drew inspiration. He got information from this uh, when the baby and the dog uh, went head to head early on in the movie. And uh, that's the movie and it was a happy end of them watching the cartoon show and Odin's and Loki went back to home and um, uh, Loki has taken a stunt, right? And his father says, don't push it. <laughs> um, so, yeah, that was some of the mess. It was a really good movie. And my opinion, I think it outdoes the original in every way. Um, except maybe the actual look of the uh, mask character. I like the look of the character because... Well, it looks more like uh, the mask, and 
Uh, you know, so, um, I didn't really get why the mask had it had plastic here, so, I thought it looked fine the way the mask did in the first one, and plus that's also more true to the mask comics that these, uh, that, the, that these, uh, movies are loosely based off of. Uh, and that's it.